Welcome to Introverted Icon TV. Like and subscribe for more updates. Introverted Icons, tap in. Alright y'all, today we're going to be reacting to shoplifting videos. You know, I got this video pulled up ready for y'all and we finna get into it. Let's get it. A man in a British Columbia superstore is filming an alleged shop. Hold on before I advance, man. Y'all see the new intro? Hope y'all fuck with it, man. Don't buy your boy, you know, you know, I had to I had to spice it up a little bit, you know, put a little flair to the channel. Lifter, trying to leave the store with a cart full of merchandise. You gonna pay for that? Huh? You gonna pay for that? Huh? Where? Huh? You gonna pay for it? He's dismissing the man filming. But there's someone else he's going to have to face. And she means business. Uh, <laughs> the woman who claims to have seen the man shoving roast beefs into his backpack earlier rips the man's mask off. Come on, bud. While the man filming grabs the car full of goods. Come on. Get out. Thus thwarting the alleged would be thief. Though he does get away with his backpack. Come on. He is later Ryan, identified and, and arrested for theft. Shake your go. The woman who confronted the shoplifter was 73-year-old former bank teller Elaine Galloway. <laughs> who was once reportedly held at gunpoint while at work. And they say, nah, nah, what? So shoplifters, if you're thinking of stealing anywhere near Elaine, <laughs> think again. Guys, you're not a cop. I know he's just... Okay, I got you recording, honey. It's okay. Two loss prevention employees have apprehended a teenage girl they believe was shoplifting inside a Washington supermarket. Police are allowed to do that. They're showing too rough. Yeah, what are the Let her go! The young woman reportedly fled the store when loss prevention staff tried to detain her for concealing candy. Doing all this over a candy. Like, y'all, loss prevention motherfuckers need to sit down somewhere. Now, they're trying take, to force take, her- Take your job too serious, brother. Back inside. Sparking the ire of other customers witnessing the altercation. Are you are you a cop? Do you have a badge? Yeah, you you don't have yeah, absolutely. But the more the young woman resists being apprehended, the more physical things become. No, oh, you, are, you are gonna get arrested. You're gonna yeah, get arrested. I got it on video. You know this is way beyond what you're supposed you to do. Hey, hey, let her go. What are you doing, man? Get up, get up. She's Oh, I'm posting this all over social media. Look at all these people. Nigga wanna be a hero so bad. Boy, talking ain't about to give you no raise. Ain't about to do shit for you. She wanna walk out with some candy? I don't give I'm gonna act like I ain't see it. Shit, what the fuck? Customers step in to try to calm the young girl down. I got you on video, honey. It's going all over social media. But the struggle continues as the loss prevention employees eventually manage to pull the distraught teen to her feet and get her inside the store's lobby while continuing to defend their tactics to outraged customers. Yeah, she shouldn't have been stealing, but all this over candy, bro. Hey, yes, it does! I'm hitting the fuck out of this space body to chill. <laughs> You're hurting her. You're hurting your business. Yes, You're hurting your business. You're hurting your business. Okay? Get out of here. Yeah. You lost prevention. You lost prevention. That boy say leave the store. You're not trespassing. <laughs> Bro wants some authority so bad. With his red shirt on. Exactly. Mr. Target. Man. You guys have to keep it. A police officer finally arrives as each party pleads their case. They literally beat her. They ain't beat her. I 
I hope he's exaggerating shit. You ain't got to lie. God damn. The tense situation finally comes to an end. The 14-year-old is arrested and charged with robbery. Whoa. Arrested and charged with robbery over some candy, bro. What the fuck kind of candy she was stealing? That high-class shit. While the store releases a statement in support of their security's actions. Hey, hey, let her go! Had to be in a fortunate state of affairs where there are no clear winners. This woman was allegedly caught shoplifting at this pharmacy in Hillsboro, Oregon. You're not gonna go anywhere. We're gonna call the police. <laughs> the store security guard is preventing her from fleeing. Oh, Tight. But she's now claiming she was brought back into the store against her will. You just hurt me in the parking lot. You don't shoplift here. You can go somewhere else, but not here. Fine. Let me go somewhere else. The security guard is gripping the woman's bag because he believes it contains the stolen goods. You're not going anywhere. You shoplift. You stay right here, and we're going to call the police. You're going to get arrested. It's yeah. real simple. Let go with my but the woman seems to be willing to do whatever it takes to leave with her bag. Oh, you gonna start kicking? Yes. You gonna start kicking out the shot? Start, 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 start kicking. You hurt me in the park. You shot it. As the tug of war escalates, the situation quickly spins out of control. Oh, really? I'm gonna take you down for that now. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you say, oh, really? Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Bro, just let her go, like. What she was doing? The security guard What's remains determined to detain the unruly like really woman until police arrive. <laughs> Even as other customers. This look like a CVS or a Walgreens, bro. Like, what the fuck? Advise him to ease off. Man, that's serious, bro. I don't want it. I don't want it. She's going to a store employee tries to divert out. customers Shut away up. from the fray. He told me you have something to check out, please. Let go of it! Please check out. But this epic struggle is far from over. Stop it! Oh, start oh, shit. She swung on that nigga. Stop it! Stop it. I don't like Nobody, nobody Stop it. I am you're being filmed, man. At last, Stop it. police arrive, and the woman finally bails on her purse. Come here. Can I have my glasses, please? He actually is. You know that, right? bad for you. The other way. Don't move. Got it? Yeah. Put your feet together. The 26-year-old woman is a... She thought, the, she thought the cop was going to be on her side. See how she tried to turn around and look at him. Like, I'm white. You're white, too. Be on my side. Turn your stupid ass around. Nobody want to hear what the fuck you got to say. Arrested without further incident and charged with third-degree robbery. Because the security officer has authority to, to detain a customer if there's probable cause that shoplifting occurred, he is not charged with anything. Still, though, this shit crazy. A disturbing right. situation that is wholly serious. preventable he stole by not you, shoplifting bro. in the first place. Oh, oh, really? Really? I'm gonna take you down for that now! I gotta stop putting out energy into these companies, bro. At a clothing you. boutique, hey, a security will, camera baby. records we a customer browsing with the help of an employee. Everything appears normal, but while store owner Sofia Romo is away from the shop, she gets an alert about some suspicious activity. My manager said the shop was really busy. Um, if I could check the cameras, because he thought this lady was stealing, and so I checked the cameras remotely on my phone. Sophia believes she spots the woman putting items in her purse, and tells her manager. That big ass purse. Who all around that big ass purse? It looked like she came to steal. Got the whole he decides to follow on. her out 
at the shop because I told him I was only five minutes away. I could be there in five minutes. The manager takes a photo of the woman as she leaves the store and informs Sophia as he follows the woman down the street and onto a bus. And I was like, okay, well, I'm by the next bus stop. I'm going to hop on. And so I got on the bus and just immediately started recording. Guys, okay, so this raggedy ass bitch just came into erotic and stole from my store. Yeah, she followed up to the bus. Here's one thing you need to do before buying anything online. Don't spend another dime on Amazon until you... But see, this one I say going, you know, certain lengths are worth it because it's your store. If you own the store and you want to make sure nobody's stealing from you, then cool. Do what you got to do. But if you just a employee, bro, you just a worker. They don't care about you, Mr. LP. I don't give a fuck. Let me let you go. Stop from my store. Okay, stop. Don't touch me. And we're going to follow her to her house. Because she said she's going to pay for it there. Right? Yes. Okay. So, enjoy the ride. Sophia believes she has caught the woman red-handed. And she isn't done making her point. Let's play a game called Look in the Thief's Purse. Let's we'll see what she has. Stopped. Oh, she also took a skirt. Don't stand. Did you see that? What? Yeah. Honestly, I'm fed up. This happens all the time, like multiple times a week. And we're not able to catch them like while they're doing it every time so i had the opportunity to actually catch her you raggedy bitch you look at me like i'm crazy and you stole from me the irony it feels really yeah, personal because it is personal sophia contacts the police and when the woman exits the bus she is arrested and charged with misdemeanor theft the only thing she said to me, like, when we got off the bus, before the cops got there, she was like, this is harassment. I'm like, poor you, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, what do you, like, you can't steal from people and expect your actions not to have consequences. And I don't know what kind of world she's living in, but there were consequences that day. The woman is released on bond, and the case is currently pending. You look at me like I'm crazy, and you stole from me. The irony. A store clerk and an alleged shoplifter are engaged in a brutal tug of war at a grocery store in Hawaii. And things are escalating quickly. The suspected shoplifter appears to be attempting to flee after the employee tussling with him allegedly spotted him putting bottles of wine in his backpack. I'm trying to get drunk. The employee ah, slows him down discount. by keeping a firm grasp on his backpack full of goods, which is still on his back. <laughs> and as she now drags him back into the store, the employee <laughs> offers the alleged shoplifter an ultimatum. Let go. Give me my wine, you can get me. Come on. Go. 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 The man finally releases several bottles of wine. But the employee refuses to relent until she gets them all. <laughs> Alright, y'all, that's all we got for today. Hope you liked the video. I'm Honeyway Jake. Make sure you like and subscribe. We out.